Hello everyone, it's Kelsey here and today I have a little bit different of a project to share with you guys. Um, we're trying to save some money for the beach and I like to save money with the envelope system where you um, take cash and put it in an envelope and save it up. That seems to be the way we save money the best in my house. So I decided to make a fun envelope using pa this paper which is from the Peer Collection which was a crepe paper summer collection a couple years ago. And then I'm also going to be playing with the newer stuff from Create Paper, and um, it's called Poolside. So I borrowed this envelope punch board from my friend, so that's why I'm not an expert at using it. And you just, it's really simple to use, though. Um, I had used one before, but it had been a while, but this was really just so easy. Um, so I forgot to punch the <laughs> rounded holes, but I'm going to go back and do that. But basically, you just cut the paper to the size that it tells you to, and you just punch and score, and it's super easy. Um, it's just really fun to work with. And of course, if you didn't have this, you could just trace an envelope, open it up all the way, trace it onto a piece of pattern paper, and cut it out and make the folds yourself. That'd be really easy, too. So I should have cut this flap down a little bit more in the middle, just because it's a little, uh, there's still some adhesive on it um, that kind of sticks to the inside of the envelope, but you'll see here in a minute what I mean. So I should have, I trimmed it down quite a bit, but it still will stick to that inside piece. But just something to remember if you have a punch board or you're going to cut your own envelope is just be less liberal with the adhesive. <laughs> so anyway, now I have this cute little envelope that is so beachy. And, um, of course, I have to decorate it. I actually had a lot of fun with this project. Um, it was just something different, and it was less stressful, and I didn't have to find the perfect photo. It was just very, very nice. I really enjoyed making this. So the envelope is still a pretty small size. I basically measured a regular envelope, and that's the size that I decided to go with because I didn't want one too big or too small. So... Um, so then I had to really look over these poolside ephemera and chipboard and sticker pieces just because I didn't want anything too large, but I did want to decorate it. And it was kind of fun to think of mimicking how an envelope would look going through the mail, which was kind of the idea whenever I started out with some of these pieces. So I still kept the stamp type thing in the upper right hand corner and I put a strip at the top left but then from there it kind of um, went in a different direction and I actually had some trouble with this poolside chipboard so even though I gave it a really good review on a cherry on top and I do really love all the elements on there um, you're gonna see that I have some big issues with it and unfortunately when I contacted a cherry on top they said it's not an issue um, with just one thing that the the adhesive is like too strong so your chipboard rips up and you then you don't have adhesive on the back of your chipboard so that's a real bummer to me I'm really upset about that because I love the chipboard pieces but it makes it really hard there you can see um, it's just not cut through as well as a lot of the other chipboard pieces that I've seen in the past so, um, and I even looked to make sure it was supposed to be adhesive, and it is supposed to have adhesive on it, um, but when I wrote the company, they just said that it was the adhesive or something was too strong, and that it was an issue with all of their stuff, and um, they did offer me a refund or a store credit, but not replacement products, since that's how they all were, so... I told them to pass along my feedback to Crate Paper because I was pretty upset about it. So anyway, he, and you can tell that you had to kind of dig up more with your scissors or a paper piercer because these pieces don't want to come up. So here I'm just playing around. I really, really love this beach ball. I really want to use it, but I just can't quite figure out how to go on there. I think it's just because it was so large, um, I couldn't quite figure it out. So I am going to adhere that gold chipboard um, arrow there. And I just thought it looked really cute. And this summer, I definitely knew I wanted it in that left-hand corner to be kind of the address bar. And then I figured out how to use this 
diver. I think it looks perfect. It's just kind of diving into the rest of the envelope. So that is all for this little layout envelope thing. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you again soon. Have a great day, everyone.